So the space that you live and work in is really important. If you are an artist or a creative, your space, your physical space around you is important. It may be important for others as well. I'm not sure. Um, maybe that people, some people don't really care about it, but as a sensorily <laughs> oriented person, like I'm a visual artist, you might be a different kind of artist, but the senses are really important to us. And if it's, if there's irritations in the space, like, um, <laughs> like the all the dirt that piles up in the in the hallway you know it's like it's, it's a small irritation or the, you know not having the counter cleared off it's a small irritation it takes a minute or two to deal with it so my suggestion to you is to look at your space and and ask yourself what is irritating me here what would feel really good to have um, dealt with, cleaned up, made pretty. How can I make this space prettier, nicer? Look around and go with the one that is most irritating and most small, <laughs> like the little tiny things, right? The little tiny things are very helpful because there's part of you that notices it and feels it as an irritation and as an admonition. Oh my God, I can never keep the house clean. You know, this is one of my voices. I can't keep the house clean. Well, in fact, you know, it's not that difficult. It, uh, it just is about turning it from I should into I can do this as a place of self-care. And self-care is important in order for me to keep going with what I'm doing. Mm. All right. Talk to you soon. Val Gilman, Taproot Arts and Insight.